What up, people? We're gonna try to give this vlog thing, YouTube thing, a shot again. I did try it last year and kind of fell off just because of the circumstances I was just going through. I'm on my way to the gym right now. We're about to get a leg day session. Sunday, come back, cook some wings, watch some football, and uh, it's about to be a fun day. Legs is about to be super brutal, and I'm very excited to take you guys along with me. It's gonna be fun. So, uh, let's play some music. Not the moves, not the moves, not the moves. Shout out to Travis, look mom I can fly. That shit was a dope fucking movie. I uh, took some nitric oxide to get a little bit of a better pump. I am out of pre-workout. I need to get some new pre-workout as of today. We're just gonna go with the rain. Now we about to start lunges, baby. Get these legs a little bit warm. I always walk a quarter mile before every workout. I like doing a little warm up like that to get my mind right, get me prepared for the hell I'm about to put my body through. It's always essential to uh, warm up your muscles before you actually start stretching. I always do, on leg day, quarter mile, um, treadmill, incline 10, speed 3.4, 3.2, around there. And I go straight into the lunges right after, and then I'll uh, mix it up. Hey guys, you gotta do a quick little voiceover as I stretch. I do want to apologize for how choppy the video is. This is my first video. I didn't gather my thoughts um, before I would speak. So I do want to apologize. Just stay uh, patient with me and the videos will get better. As you see right here, I'm just doing toe touches, getting my hamstrings warmed. I am on Julian Smith's workout program. I am not going to take any credit for that. I am not going to tell you what my sets are, what my reps are because he does charge for that, and if you guys like the way I train, it is all him. I am not taking any credit for it. He has a lot of helpful things on there, such as nutrition and structural videos. He gives you a new workout every single day, never the same reps, never the same workout. Always changing, always different. Let's run this now. We're about to get this. As you guys see right here, this is my top set on leg press. This required for my feet to be low and inside shoulder width. Um, next movement, I am using this instead of a hack squat movement, just because we don't have one at the gym. So like I thought, recording threw me off. It's like the momentum changed until I put the camera away. Started stiff leg deadlifts. I feel the adrenaline coming back in, zone focus, so let's run it. Getting ready to do stiff leg deadlifts, 275 on the bar, did it for a top set of 6 reps, and then I moved on to the next movement, which was seated leg curls for 12 reps. Fucking eyes are like swollen, homie. Um, maybe it's because I went to bed like at 1 and woke up at 8. <laughs> but 7 hours of sleep, right? Um, didn't finish, I didn't finish, I didn't film. The entire workout because one, I can't give away all of Julian's secrets away, his program away. Um, second, I needed to step away from the camera and kind of just go into my small world population of one. No one in the gym. It did make my rest times a lot longer and that's something I didn't like at all so I need to figure out and balance that. Headed out, gathered my stuff um, on the way to the crib. I just want to keep touching up on and just rant basically. I want to inspire others. I want to be better every day and do better. I want to inspire my sister, I want to inspire my mom, I want to inspire my dad, I want to inspire everyone that surrounds me. I want to do things that make me happy and uh, working out makes me happy and uh, I want to share that with the world. That song that I had showed earlier in the video when I was doing my stiff leg deadlifts is Levi Bentley. I found him about two years ago. I've been following him for two years now. He vlogs, he does a whole Instagram thing, um, and he's fucking fresh. Uh, this this dude has some pretty fresh drip, swag, steez, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I just want to play you that song. The song is just a different vibe for me. The way I pick my music is like, if it feels, if it resonates in my soul and just like feels like a feeling, like I know it's a good song, like right off the bat. 
Racks on water, no fairy, bitch, I'm splashing out Yeah, diamonds on me, was scary, bitch, they jumping out Tell you about the guapo, can you cap it now? Right there. Right there? Yeah. Where my dad is, at least. Yo, what up, guys? Second day recording. On the way to the gym. My boy stopped by after work. What's up? That's all you're gonna say? What's up? Just posted right now. Just posted. It's my boy Braden. Yo, you gotta go check out that drip, though. What is that? Oh no, this is nothing bro. Just wait, just wait. Give me Something's a in the works right now yeah, for my boy. He's doing work. his thing and uh, I'm super fucking proud of him. Um, you guys are gonna have to just wait and see what he has in the works for you guys. Some crazy shit. On oh, some crazy shit. Yeah, that should go hard. That should go hard. That should go hard. <laughs> Chest and biceps today, yesterday. Told you guys it was a little bit fucking hard to record and work out at the same time. Day two, back at it. I wasn't gonna vlog because I wasn't feeling it because of yesterday's workout was like just long and just not how I wanted it to be. Rest time too long, but uh, I need to stay consistent. So we're gonna record again today. Probably mix the two videos together. So I have a little bit more content. So you guys can just view as one video instead of two because I'm not trying to have a five minute video. I don't even know why I went this way. I was about I was to ask about, you that, bro. About to go straight to the gym. I forgot about taking him home. <laughs> oh, no, I gotta take this little homie home. He's about to do his thing, chill at home, get some food in him, and I'm about to do my thing. But I'll check in with you guys right now. Niggas is mad. So we made it inside the gym. Uh, well, we made it to the gym. We're inside the bathroom right now. Um, there's quite a few people here. Here. <laughs> There's a, quite a few people here and uh, just out of respect, I'm gonna just set the camera down and kind of do a voiceover uh, again. Um, now, really talking, probably like same stuff kind of thing. Just uh, bear with me, getting used to recording myself, so it's a little weird. And uh, not super comfortable in front of the camera, feel awkward, feel weird. Um, but we're gonna get after it. Let's go. I get more butt than ass trays. Fuck a fair one, I get mine the fast way. Ski mass way, nigga ransom notes. Far from handsome, but damn a nigga tote. Much more guns than roses. Foes is shaking in their boots. A visible bully, like the gooch disappear. Van moose, you whack to me. Take them rhymes back to the factory. I see the gimmicks, the whack lyrics. The shit is depressing, pathetic. Please forget it. You're mad cause my style you're admiring. Don't What's up guys, we just finished stretching. About to finally start working out. Um, do a quick little outfit check. White vans with that black accent with white socks. Some short shorts from H&M and an independent trucks T. From Active Ride Shop and a no name five panel. A um, little bit white boy vibes going on right now. Skated growing up, had a friend that was super fucking sick. Shout out to Chris Castellano, fucking dude was a beast. He's always super sick, started skating because of him and just hung out and skated because that's what they did. And it was always super fucking fun and it kind of just stuck with me. Like I just love skate wear, dickies, stuff like that, bands, kind of my thing right now. We're about to finally start working out. It calls for machine press, but there's no machine press, so we're just gonna do Smith machine bench press. And uh, since it will keep it controlled, and all I have to do is worry about the contraction instead of the entire complete movement, it'll keep it stationary, thus allowing me to focus on the pump. I woke up with like a bug bite or pimple on my freaking nose. It hurts. I think it's a bug bite. Um, all good. So let's run it. Be bad, UPS is hiring. You should have been the cop, fuck hip hop. With that freestyle, you're bound to get shot. Not from Houston, but I rap a lot. Pack the gap a lot, the flame's about to drop. Uh. Here comes the brand new flavor in you. Time for new flavor in you. I'm just kicking new flavor in you. No rap, no 
crap, you bore me. One to grab my dick, too lazy. Hold it for me. I'm straight back, great. Bust the head straight and. And that is the end of the motherfucking workout. You guys go home with me. I'm about to cook. You guys see what I'm gonna eat? Cause I got 2,000 calories still left for the damn day, and it is already 9:30, 10. Let me grab my stuff. Grab my phone. Before I head on out, I want to give you guys a little quick gym tour to see what the vibe is. Standing, uh, calf raise. You got your seated calf raise. You have your leg extension. You have your seated leg curl. You got your abductors, adductors, both right next to each other. You know what I'm saying? You know what the fuck going on. You got your leg press, assisted pull up. Forgot the actual name for that one. What's the exact name? Uh, I forgot. But you know what it is. You've seen these before. It's a functional cable. I forgot. You have your cables. You can do your TRX right there. You can do your pull ups right here. You can do some biceps right there. This is a little trampoline that you can throw a ball on, kind of a little different. You have your punching bag. You can do dips right here, dips right here, abs right there. Let's go over here. This section over here, you got some battle ropes over there. All of the smaller dumbbells are going to be right here from two or three pounds all the way up to 15 on this side. Got your kettlebells, one more kettlebell, slam balls right here. Probably already said it. Barbells, you have some plates right here just in case for this. You have your hammer incline press. You have a pec deck. You have a back, seated back, T-bar row. And then you have your dual stack. And then you walk over here, attachments right there. Glute builder, shout out to them. Got a tire right there, you got the turf right here. You got more accessories over there. You got your balls right there, more uh, slam balls and um, sandbags. Some cardio right here, another booty thing. Cardio, cardio, set master, power rack. Smith machine, decline, more barbells, hyperextension, all of the dumbbells right here. So a little quick gym tour. Let's go in the bathroom so you guys know what it is. Well, you guys kind of saw it already. You walk in, beautiful changing room. A little bit more of an upscale changing room. That's what the gym is. Bathroom, normal bathroom. And uh, there's a couple more bathrooms of women. Two women, two men, and that's the gym. And I absolutely couldn't be more happy with what's inside the gym. Got a little waiting room. Got all of uh, Tiana's clothing right there. The gym's clothing. And then we have like this wall of members, trainers, clients, stuff like that. So when someone else is here, the worker's name is Levi. He'd be kicking in behind the desk. But little quick gym tour. Oh man, I am dead. Let's stretch a little bit before I head out because I always freaking forget. I'll just cool down with the bar. Keep my shoulders good. Stretch out that chest since I did chest today. And biceps. That was it. Let's head on home and go get a 2,000 calorie meal in some way, somehow. I do it all the time since uh, I lack on food so much. I'm trying to park, but there's shopping carts in every damn freaking parking spot. It's ridiculous. I want to show you guys this. Look, look, this is ridiculous. Shopping cart, right? The thing is right there. Yo, I don't know. America, you guys are fucking lazy, though. That shit is crazy, dude. You cannot walk five feet that you're in that big of a rush to get home or do whatever you need to do. You got issues, dude. We're in Target. I'm about to get some grub. It's about to be fucking good. I'm excited. Cereal. Dope. Should I do cereal or granola? Alright, let's see what kind of granola they got. That's uh, something that I've incorporated. Either granola as cereal. It is so good. Granola is so bomb. Yo. They have dope ones. I'm not even gonna lie. I haven't been to Target in forever. So what are we about to eat? You have grain free, maple, almond, holy crap. I am just so hungry, everything looks so good to me. We're probably just gonna go with the oats and honey, honestly. Now it's time to go get that pizza. They don't even have it. So I have veggie lovers, which I'm down to try. But the one I get is a meat lovers one, and I do not see it at all. Damn, I am pretty sad all good pizza fucking sounds pretty fucking good to me see what this veggie love is looking like homie 
we have secured the games, boy. About to go home, grub, and it's about to be lit. I'm back. I'm home. Look who came down. You come say hi. You come say hi. What's up, baby? Good boy. You're a good boy. This is Flex right here. Do baby. Push up. Push up. So plan right now is to input the entire pizza, then see how much is left for the cereal. Cause I'm definitely in the entire pizza. This dude is just licking away. Today is just a snack night and I'm kind of freaking happy. <sighs> right on the freaking money, man. Holy crap. Didn't even know that was gonna happen. So like I said, my cards for the day is 436 and I made it perfect 436 oh my god i ran out of storage sick fucking bullshit so i guess this is gonna conclude the vlog right here i have zero minutes on my sim card but that is it checking out with you guys peace homies um if you guys like the video please like it subscribe comment share it do that shit bro